Hey there, welcome to my channel. My name is Nyasha. As we've seen from the title, today I'm doing a review of the newly launched Estee Lauder Double Way Sheer Long Makeup with SPF 19. I went to Dillard's and I wanted to get myself uh, the, the foundation. But pretty much when I got there, they matched me to Deep Amber, which I'm going to be reviewing in this video. But unfortunately, they didn't have it in stock. So I ended up getting a sample. The beauty consultant was kind enough to give me a sample of that foundation. And here I am with this sample right here. And I'm going to be showing it to you guys. But pretty much what I'm going to do is I'm going to read to you what they say about it. So I'm going to do a swatch of this at some point. But firstly, I'm just going to read to you what they say about this double wear, sheer long wear makeup. Like I said, the shade that they matched me with is the shade deep amber which is an extra deep with neutral brown undertones when i went over there i thought i was going to get a different shade i had a different shade in mind but then when she swatched it it just wasn't giving my skin life my skin was looking you know very ashy it just was not working for me and that shade is truffle because for some reason i thought like i thought that truffle was going to work for me but it didn't work so she ended up matching me with deep amber 7 in 1 and i feel like it's my shade but we're gonna we're gonna see when i apply the whole face because i know she swatched here and so she swatched here and it looked like my shade pretty much so I'm going to read here a little bit what they say about it. So they say it's a sheer natural matte foundation with up to 24 hour wear SPF and skincare benefits. And they also say it's a light coverage foundation. So it's, I don't know, maybe something between a foundation and a skin tint. The finish is matte. The SPF is 19. And they also say it's a sheer long wear makeup with spf 19 i've already said that and it also leaves the skin soft and gives a soft matte finish it's also undetectable mm -mm -mm. who doesn't want that because <laughs> i know for a fact i don't want makeup that's going to be showing i don't like makeup that's boom in your face so definitely i like that and it's also the foundation visibly even skin tone and smooth skin surface mm -mm, that's amazing okay <laughs> that's going to even my skin tone definitely i want it it resists sweat and humidity with no caking and helps protect against uv rays and pollution and it has spf again i've said that i think for the third or fourth time i don't know <laughs> so that's pretty much what they say about this foundation so i feel like it's just the the the, the double way foundation but this one is just lighter so i'm gonna do a swatch of this before i start blending it out i've already done my eyes and my eyebrows because i don't want to waste anyone's time because i know if you click this video you definitely want to see a review of this foundation you didn't come for a whole full-blown tutorial so i'm only gonna do oh look at that that's what i'm talking about when you apply your foundation you definitely want it to just disappear i am really tired of buying shades that don't match me but this one when i apply it immediately just look at that it disappears and i also like the fact that it's a neutral because my undertone sometimes it beats me so pretty much now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna start by priming my face because i'm an oily mess i moisturize my face and when i moisturize i really moisturize all right so now i'm done with my primer as you can see some of the shine on my face is already gone so now i'm gonna take the little container shake it up because she did say that she said i have to shake it really shake it before i apply it so i'm gonna shake it i don't know how much of it i'll need because it's a very thin formula so i'm gonna try and do it like oh good lord look at that <laughs> i wasn't expecting to take out that much i'm gonna put it back into the bottle oh my god because i don't want to waste it but look at that oh that is so wasteful so that's the other thing when you're taking it out it's so watery and so runny you need to be careful because now i just lost all of that yep i did because i can't put it back into the bottle i thought i would but i cannot do that look at that i can't even tilt it that much because i might end up spilling it but just look at that that's how much i ended up getting on this thing and that is quite a lot since it's a light coverage formula i'm gonna use a concealer to cover this part of my face my nose so concealing my under eye area because my under eye area is a bit 
darker compared to the rest of my face so I'm going to apply a bit of concealer there as well I said I'm using a beauty blender to blend out the foundation so I'm going to dip my finger look at that it's really watery Ooh, I love this shade I really do I'm not going to add any more so I'm going to blend out what I have already oh the good thing about a thin formula is that it's so easy to blend look at that I'm in love already I'm definitely in love already and I feel like this is my perfect perfect when I say perfect I mean perfect match And the way it's really so easy to blend, it's unbelievable. So I don't know if you can see the sheer coverage that they talk about. It's definitely sheer, but it's also like very easy to blend. And it's literally just disappearing because they said it's undetectable and I see it. I really do because it's just disappearing into the skin. I don't know if you can tell, but it's like my skin and the formula is just becoming one. Look at that. So I guess the only way you can deal with the sheerness is pretty much using a concealer before you apply it, like what I did. I applied a concealer in my problem areas and it worked. So maybe, I don't know if I should apply a bit more, but I think I'm okay to be honest. I don't believe I need to apply any more. Maybe a bit more here because that is definitely like a problem area and I feel like because it's a thin formula it's definitely beautiful and you're not gonna look cakey because it just disappears look at that oh my word it just disappears into the skin I cannot believe this I really cannot believe this. The only thing I'm gonna say is it doesn't look matte to me, but since they say it's a semi-matte, maybe that's what it is, because it's not shimmer shimmer, but at the same time, it's not like a really matte as well. When they say it's a softly diffused matte finish, I guess this is what they mean because I mean <laughs> it's not it's not like matte matte. You know what I mean? So I'm using a translucent powder. And then I'm using the Laura Messier translucent powder in the shade Honey with the RT setting brush to just put some powder underneath my eyes like that. And then I'm using an orange blush to just apply to the cheeks, bring a bit of color. I'm using the mark well well <laughs> lipstick okay last but not least I'm gonna use the Morphe spray setting spray I love the setting spray and voila we are done we are done we are done that was like a very very quick makeup tutorial makeup application i've ever done in my whole life literally and i think it's mainly because blending out this is like a dream it is so easy and how it pretty much looks like my skin i cannot believe it i cannot believe how it looks like it literally looks like my skin you know mm -mm -mm. and we are done <laughs> And we're done and this is what my makeup is looking like I absolutely love it let me know what you think I just happen to have like really oily skin and I guess that is why my skin is looking like this because I believe it's looking really oily at this point I'm tempted to just apply a bit more translucent powder especially around my nose area like here I just feel like I should apply a bit more because it looks so greasy and oily but i love how i'm looking compared to the other estee lauder i do have a video where i did a full review of the other estee lauder compared to the other estee lauder i would say this one is 
easy to work with because it's so easy to blend blending it is like a dream if you like the natural look i feel like if you live for the natural look like i do i feel like you need to get this for yourself i really do because i'm gonna get the whole thing because it's saving right now <laughs> I'm so sorry, I can't, I can't stop looking at my name. Otherwise, thank you so much for coming, guys, to my channel. I really appreciate you. If you have any comments, do leave them in the comment section below. If you want to get in touch with me, there's an email address down below as well. And also, if you want to leave a comment, if you have any questions, just leave them in the comment section as well. If you're not yet subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. And also, if you like this video, feel free to like it, like literally putting a like on this video. And also, feel free to share the video with your friends, with the people. <laughs> But otherwise, for me, for now, it's bye.